What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to Steve Busa GS3. Got another score card reaction for y'all, and you already know what it is. Let's get it, yo, GS gang. What is popping? We got a little tournament thing going on. Let me get bring you up to speed as to what just happened. All right. Uh, I finally had a chance to tap in with Terry the Rap Man on the channel for the first time after Moto told us to tap in uh, during our interview. And let me just say, he was right. Mo9 is not a plug, all right? So I wanted to go. I pulled up his IG. I was about to hit him and just be like, yo, thanks for the plug. You was right. I really fuck with his sound. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're working on doing some shit to, to you know, educate myself better with Terry. And, you know, we'll get the interview worked out and all the other shit. And I seen that he had the new album drop. Nobody fucking tagged me in it. So I was like, cool. First thing I did, jump right over to a... Uh, to to, to what's it called Bandcamp yeah went over right over to Bandcamp we downloaded the whole album uh, it was like 25 bucks or something like that I, threw, I think you can put whatever you want through 25 bucks at it you get the whole album there's a ton of tracks on there we're gonna randomly pick one to react to today but if you guys want more from the album here's what I want you guys to do tag me on IG on fucking Twitter on something showing your proof of purchase that you went through Bandcamp and you purchased the album and then with that purchase you get one request i'll give you one request over of the album for what song you want to see reacted to but you gotta have copped it that's just this is a nice little fun holiday you know what i'm saying like session we about to get into it with uh we want to make sure that we're going and trying to push things that we think will actually help artists and shit like that plus i just want to show my respect and gratitude for him taking the time to plug me with some fucking dope shit and i just want to hear the album because i'm selfish so y'all got until uh we'll call it mid mid january we'll, we'll call it january 15th to go and cop the album show the receipts and put your request in otherwise i paid for it i'm listening to the whole damn album at that time so we'll go into it that way uh do me a favor run the gown and hit the like button hit the subscribe button I'm a little bell notification guy we about to eat man let's go this is fun also if these guys uh, if you haven't checked any of my list couple of reactions or anything like that uh, i just want to say happy holidays uh, I'm, I'm sending y'all love on behalf of myself for the whole gs gang i uh, hope you guys are happy healthy spend time with your loved ones get everything that you want eat be merry and be safe please i want to see y'all here for the new year 2023 about to be big for everybody so i'm sending y'all nothing but blessings and love and i i hope y'all really really like get get the most out of the season you know what i'm saying like let's get into it man my yo the energy is like ah, this is so good i hope i don't put on no like super gangster shit now i'm like super like in just like a, a positive mode he gonna make me go out and start doing drive-bys if we get some really hard shit uh let's go which one do we want to do i'm gonna just pick one at random mm, we got some feature from tanzania that's actually I don't want to do the self name one yet. That's probably right. That's probably like the the showman track. Let's just pick one. Boom, number seven. It's true. We're gonna go with it's true. Yes, yes, yo. Time to tell the truth. Word is born. Yeah, it goes check sarcasm. Night job we healthy. Thanks for supporting and big enough just the wealthy. IG fakers only winning in they selfies. This the unhealthy rebirth of envy. Scammers rocking Gucci, Louis, Fendi, getting followers and likes. See a thief to you, we trend you. Every one of these fanboys on. Ah, he said he's a thief to you, we trendy, dog. We different. We built different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We here for this. Bring that back. I'm in with this. I like, it's got that, it, I don't want to say jazz, but it's got that kind of like smooth, cool jazz kind of like vibe to it. You know what I'm saying? Not necessarily like, I guess jazz isn't the right word, but it does. It's got that, that slickness to it. You know what I'm saying? I like the beat. Oh, no. There we go. See, and this is how you'll know I respect Mode 9 too. I hate doing reactions not on YouTube. I hate it. It's, it's like it's like literally like it's so much more difficult. Now everything's all blue tinted and stuff like that. Ruins my aesthetic. Don't matter. This, this is how we show love by stepping out of our comfort zone, right? Let's get it. Let's get it. One more time. One more time. One more time. Now we know what we're in for. We picked a good one. Yes, yes, yo. Time to tell the truth. Word is born. Yeah, it goes. Check sarcasm. Night job we held it. Thanks for supporting and picking up just the wealthy. IG fakers only winning in they selfies. This the unhealthy rebirth of envy. 
scammers Rockin' Gucci, Louis Fendi Get it followers and likes He a thief to you, we trendy If you one of these fanboys, unfriend me It's like that You can't push, twist, or bend me Don't send me I'm already labeled a hater Cause they scared of the truth They only care about their paper ah. fans, man, Yo, that's what we hear for, baby I be living vicariously through those bars, man Let's go, you already know you know how many people say I'm... Nah, right, come on. We're not going to make it about us. I'm narcissistic. I can't help it. Everything... Music is supposed to be related to. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel. I always be relating to shit. Come on. Scared of the truth. They only care about their paper. My real fans, man, they never played us. I guess I got some powerful enemies back in Lagos. It's chaos. You can't beat them. Join them. Never. I'm going to play my position forever. Ah! This is my fan letter addressed to all the Pharisees of fake translators. Let's go. Yo, we picked the one. We picked the one. Nigeria. Events of the past few years have indicated that despite our great human and material resources, the government has not been able to fulfill the legitimate expectations of our people. So. I'm conflicted now, right? I want you guys to know that I was paying attention to what was being said, and the message is very real. But the beat and shit, like, I couldn't help. Like, I was, like, feeling and shit like that. And in my brain, it's like, dog, this is probably not something you should be bopping to while he's saying that. I want y'all to know that I acknowledge that and that it was to the beat. You feel me? Let's, let's get into it. Place to Nigeria, my country. my country. To be faithful, loyal, but now I'm hungry. Our leaders try to sell the whole nation on gum tree. If they could, they woulda strung me up and ripped me. I got a weird feeling the government tricked me. A reoccurring loop since 1960. Far from nifty, it's mad when someone ah. risks me. Search through my phone, rob me, protest is risky. Accusing me of scamming, breath smelling of whiskey. Oh Lord, save Nigeria from backward ancient rules and criteria. He searched. Go! Dog, this is a story that's been told a million and million and one times. You get someone like Mo Nine who's like, you know, got celebrity behind them, this guy like, you know, working hard for what he got and shit like that. And I, I've heard the stories a million and one times, you know what I'm saying? Just because you look a certain way, you act and move a certain way, they automatically just like put you in that 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 Yahoo fucking kind of like box, you know what I'm saying? So like he I I feel what he's saying on this shit. I'm sorry that that's a reality, but like he's definitely getting his shit off on this one. I like this is a good one. We, I'm, I'm excited now. Let's go. He accusing me of scamming, breath smelling of whiskey. Oh Lord, save Nigeria from backward ancient rules and criteria. Nigeria. Surgeons and militants, we the new Syria. We still fight polio and malaria. Fulani herdsmen causing mass hysteria. Intelligent minds shut down for being superior by the powers that be almost Yo! Syria. Nigeria has been left. Nah, he cooked. He cooked. One more time. Bring that back. Yo. Ancient rules and criteria. Insurgents and militants. We the new Syria. We still fight polio and malaria. Fulani herdsmen causing mass hysteria. Intelligent minds shut down for being superior. By the powers that be, all motives are ulterior. Nigeria has been left to drift. Dog, it's the 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 <laughs> the fucking it, it, the the uh, use your words, Steve. The melodicness, the upbeatness of like the the, the funkiness, kind of like of the beat, is just not matching up with what's being said. And I just want to reiterate again that like my body is listening to the beat, my mind is listening to the words. Don't don't confuse him having good beat selection and shit like that with me not paying attention because I'm I'm bopping to this shit, man. It's a it's an inner fight right now, man. Situation, situation, situation. If not arrested, would inevitably have resulted in chaos and even bloodshed. In the endeavor to build a strong. Nigerians have shed much blood. The thought of father bloodshed for whatever reason must, I'm sure, be revolting to our people. The armed forces, having examined the situation, came to the conclusion that certain changes were inevitable. I, yeah, I don't know, man. This, this is a good combination of... It sounded sweet, right? Like, it sounded like a good song. 
sonically. But the me- like, if you listen and you pay attention to what he's saying the whole time, like he was not painting a, a, a beautiful picture. You know what I'm saying? Like he he was painting more of a harsh reality. Uh, and like the, the, I don't know if that's kind of like a metaphor, if he was just really fucking with the beat or if it's like, yo, even though, look, even though we're talking like, this is the reality of Nigeria, all this shit that's going on, we need to, to fix this to like really like, you know, big up everything and shit like that. It's still a beat, like there's still reason to, to, to be uh, optimistic. You know what I'm saying? Like the beat is still uplifting. It's not like, like, it's not like he put on a jaunt and it was just like, yo, it's just this dreary, dreadful beat. He's like, nah, look, this is the reality. We're all going through all this, but the, the beat is still, like, uplifted. It's still like, yo, even though you're going through all that shit, like, still have hope. Still be on your up and up and shit. That's what I take away from that. When artists decide to do that shit and you see that, like, there's there's there's, there's a message being used with the beat and the, the, the message is being delivered, that's how my brain goes to translate that shit. Um, let me know what your thoughts are on this. Let me know if you guys copped the album, what your favorite off the album was, what you think needs to be on the channel. Let's break this down. Let's go to the scorecard. Let's get small. We small. We small. Da, 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 da. Yeah, we're fans. If you guys didn't pick up on that, shout out to Mo. Uh, target audience. Yes, sir. I mean, obviously the target audience specifically uh, is going to be the people who are, are in Nigeria who are still experiencing this. But the target audience, as far as like good hip hop, good storytelling, being able to tell your truth, being able, he's talking directly to his fans who are curious about, yo, what's going on with, you know, like 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 the, the not, them not spinning this shit like that and feeling like they turned, like the country turned his back on them and shit. Like there, there was a lot of shit in there for us to feast on. You know what I'm saying? Like this is one to spin back a couple times. Uh, proper setting. This is, I have no idea. Because of that, like, this is the downside to when you have a beat that doesn't necessarily match the message that someone's sending off to you. Like, I don't know when you're putting this on. This is like, this is like, do you put it as like an uplift? Like, cause you're not gonna, it's, it's too, it's too boppy, right? Like, it's like that Sunday morning, clean your house to it and stuff like that too. But then it's like, it, it's heavy, dog. It was like the message, what he was saying was heavy. So it's like, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a make a, I'm gonna make a decision here. I think I'm, I'm gonna put this for headphones music, right? Cause like, look, he said this was him talking directly to his fans. So it doesn't like, you know what I'm saying? Like that's not necessarily for, this ain't for the people who are in the bars or the clubs and expecting this to come on. You know what I'm saying? This is like a personal message. He said, this is me talking to the, to the, the people who have been supporting me who want to know why. And that's why I'm putting headphones. I think this is good headphone music. This is for you to get your own individual message as a fan from an artist who is addressing questions that they got. You feel me? That's my final answer. Let me know what you guys agree with that. I'm actually real curious what you guys say about the setting on this one. Uh, bars or lyrics, solid 23 out of 25. I you could you can make the argument for a solid 25 out of 25. Uh, the delivery. Same thing. I'm right there. Give me that 23 out of 25 space. Super consistent beginning to end. Nothing felt forced. Nothing felt funky in that. I was fucking with it. The beat selection. Look, we're giving it a solid. Give me, give me, give me a 13. Well, look at the threes. The threes all the way down. I'm getting a 13 out of 15, right? I like the idea of being able to deliver unfortunate news or heavy news with a message that's well written and shit like that. But in a way that's still easily digestible because it sounds sweet because it sounds good more people are going to tap in because their bodies are listening and the message is going to get across to more individuals and shit like there's a lot of good things about it the only downside that that's really come up during the breakdown is setting you know what i'm saying so it's like i'm giving it a 13 out of 15 uh sound quality mixing 15 out of 15 stop it it was perfect none i would take away with that effectiveness does this make you want to tap into more stop it 10 out of 10 i want to listen to the album i bought it Y'all need to tell me what you want to listen to off of it. Enjoyability. Did you enjoy it? Uh, I give this one a solid 8 out of 10. Uh, bringing my total score to a 92. This is a cool 92 out of 100. Uh, this is this is probably one of my more favorite Mode 9 tracks too. Just because he like really was like talking and getting his shit off. Well written shit from beginning to end. Uh, let me know what y'all think. As always, I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. I will catch y'all on the next one. Let's go.